I'm sorry I beat you at Pokemon, sir. Oh no, you were reading comic books. That's so much better. You were reading comic books. You just told me. You can't watch traffic and read comic books. It's distracting. You might hurt somebody. Yeah, you also can't ride your bike with your cell phone looking down in traffic and on sidewalks. So. Was anybody hurt? Did I steal anyone's money? No, but you were doing something you shouldn't do. And I oh, I beat you at Pokemon. You. I'm sorry, sir. Well, thank you for your advice, sir, but I mean, I'm fine. See that? See, if you would have done that, that would have been much nicer. If you would have said, thank you for your advice, I'll try not to do it again, that would have been the proper answer. I was trying to have a conversation with you as a friendly not, not fellow Pokemon player, sir. Okay. What have you, sir? Comic book reader, Pokemon player. I saw you guys driving all up on the grass getting the pokey stops at 3 in the morning. I'm not stupid, I know what you're doing. You're not patrolling. Was it this SUV or was it a different one? We paid for this. We're paying for you guys to read comic books and play Pokemon oh and steal God. money from people who are better than you at video games. 92 dollars for winning at Pokemon. Yep, that's Stopping it. traffic for 10 minutes on a bridge. Because I might cause someone an inconvenience. I'm inconveniencing people. You might get hurt. You might hurt somebody else. You ever think of that? I might get hurt. That's a risk I'm willing to take. Well, riding my bicycle without a helmet like a big boy. Well, you don't need a helmet. It's not against the law to not wear it with a helmet. Well, that's a little bit more dangerous than like a cell phone. Don't you think? But you know, you don't, you're not paid to think, you're paid to enforce the law. Yep, that's me. Yep, and read comic books on the clock. Yep. Because that's better than playing Pokemon. Oh. Did you poke any men lately? Did you have to uh, do any cavity searches? Do you enjoy it? It's just part of your job, it's not any fun though, right? being a testicle fondler.